I am a girl with Asperger's syndrome. I'm the Aspie girl. Hi guys, it's Alexa. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you my hair routine. Basically, I'll be showing you how I take care of my hair and how I do my hair every day. Let's get into the video. So first of all, I only wash my hair twice a week. Believe it or not, I want my hair to get greasy as much as possible. I know it sounds gross, but when your hair gets greasy, it actually produces oil, which is really good for your hair. Having greasy, oily hair as often as possible will actually help your hair keep its moisture and prevent dryness. Washing your hair every single day actually damages your hair, believe it or not. So yeah, wash your hair as little as possible. I'll wash my hair more than twice a week if I'm going out or something, but if I'm just gonna be home, I like to let my hair get really greasy before I wash it again. However, don't go too long without washing your hair. If you go too long without washing your hair, your scalp will dry out and make your head itchy, and you'll also get dandruff, which you do not want. So yeah, wash your hair every three to four days and it'll keep your hair healthy. Shortly before I plan on getting in the shower, I like to brush my hair so that there aren't any knots in it. It'll be really difficult to wash your hair if it has knots in it. I always start at the ends of my hair and work my way up to the roots when I'm brushing it because I don't want to make my tangled hair even more tangled. Also, I like to use the kind of brush that doesn't break your hair nearly as much, like a natural bristle brush, or this brush I'm using where the bristles are not only smooth, but wide apart from each other. I then rub coconut oil all throughout my hair. I do this not only to help with moisture even more, but it makes my hair really soft and shiny, which is a good thing. Coconut oil is actually really good for your hair, so it'll keep your hair healthy and prevent breakage, which will make your hair longer too. I leave the coconut oil in my hair for about an hour, but you can leave it in overnight if you'd prefer. I then get in the shower and wash all of the coconut oil out of my hair. I then take a handful of shampoo and lather my roots really well with it, but I never put shampoo on the ends of my hair because all it does is dry out my hair, which is not nice. I then wash that out and then put conditioner on the ends of my hair, never the roots. Putting conditioner on your roots will only make your hair oily and greasy which is not what you want when you first wash your hair. I like to leave the conditioner on for a few minutes to let it really soak into my hair and produce even more moisture. I like to produce as much moisture as possible into my hair, not only to make it soft and shiny, but to keep my hair healthy and beautiful. After leaving the conditioner in my hair for a few minutes, I wash it out and then get out of the shower. I then take a wide tooth comb and comb my hair. And then I just let my hair air dry. I never use any heat on my hair or put any products in it because I want to keep my hair as healthy as possible. If I want to dry my hair fast, instead of risking my hair's health and blow drying it, all I do is just flip my hair around like this until my hair is dry. Don't worry about your hair getting messy from doing this because you're going to brush it afterwards anyway. Once my hair is dry, I'm just going to brush it. After that, I'm going to choose which hairstyle I want to wear. I'm just going to wear my hair down today. I'm going to brush my hair back to make it more voluminous, and that's pretty much my hair routine. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed watching my hair routine. If you liked this video, please subscribe for more videos on my channel. I post a new video every Friday. If you have any questions or requests for upcoming videos, please comment them down below. Thank you for watching. Bye!